Hello everyone, I'm Cesar Santiago and today I'm going to be testing Far Cry Primal on PC with the GeForce GTX 750 Ti. I'm using the day one patch as you can see down here and first PS monitoring or as you can see here I'm using cam overlay. To learn how to use it, click on the top right corner of the video where the cam logo is or just check the description below there are some links there. Well, so as you can see now I have two GPUs. Yes, why you might ask? Well, I'm using the 950 in one slot and the 750 Ti in another slot of the motherboard, so we have two there, but I'm just using the 750 Ti now, as you can see here, 750 Ti. I will be trying 1080p, full screen, 60 frames per second. Here we have graphics quality, we have high, normal, low, ultra, very high. I will start with high and then see what happens. We also have quality settings, you can change, well, Whatever you want here, just like Far Cry 4, Far Cry 3, pretty much the same. And then in advanced settings, we have B Sync mode, normal or sparse. Sparse is a caps to game at 30 frames per second, pretty useful for some of us. Then we have field of view scaling from 60 to 120. The sweet spot for me is 90 degrees, so I keep it there. Well, 1080p, high settings, everything's fine here. This is pretty disappointing, I gotta say. <laughs> I just tried a little part there and it was pretty damn disappointing. I'm going to, in case that we have a cinematic here, I'm going to skip straight to gameplay. Okay, so we're now into the game. I skipped the cinematic. Uh, it's very disappointing right now, 25 frames per second. But this is high settings, be, so I'm going to try medium right now. Let me skip this first so I can go into the options menu. Okay, so, so far, not so good. I'm sorry that I cannot show the B-Ram counter in the in camp. I forgot to turn it on for the 750 Ti. But it's around 1.9 gigabytes of usage, so keep that in mind. It uses the whole 2 gigabytes. Let's try medium, since, well, we are below 30. Our objective is to get to 30, at least. We're still below 30. Damn it. Let's try low, the lower setting 1080p. Okay, now we're getting. So this is very disappointing. Low settings for 30 frames per second at 1080p. This seems to be the best settings for 1080p. Uh, the shadows look pretty nice. Look pretty nice. Man. Everything looks very good for being low settings, I gotta say. <laughs> but it's still very disappointing. Yeah, I, I can't uh, Let's go get him. I'm on fire. Oh. try 900p now if if I have any issue I will have to restart the game the game crashed the previous time I tried to record this so let's try high settings 900p in case it crashes I will start from the beginning again but the 900p high settings so wait for that okay my game didn't crash so we're fine I'm still using the 750Ti, 900p, high settings, and uh, let's see what happens. Okay, 900p, high settings, is playable. It's 30. So I recommend if you have a 750Ti that you overclock it, um, play at high settings, 900p. It sometimes drops below 30, as you can see here. But it's way better than 1080p, low settings, in my opinion. Play a little more like this, and then switch to 720. 
Let's Super get this. Brush that. All right. I just kept something important. It doesn't matter. <laughs> I'm going to play it from the beginning then. Okay. Yeah, whatever. All right, now I'm the open area. We should know some. This is the voice actor for Deus Ex Human Revolution, Adam Jensen. It's pretty interesting. Alright. Okay, we got one of these. Oh, one, one other thing. If you want to avoid problems with Cam in this game, you should disable the overlay from Ubisoft, the Uplay overlay. That's kind of a. Well, you can destroy the overlay, it doesn't work sometimes. Uh, yeah, 900p, it's around 28 to 35 frames per second on 900p. <laughs> so I think the best way to play this is on 900p high settings instead of 1080p low settings. So keep that in mind. But uh, it's impossible to get 60s so far. At least no 70 yeah. Some people have been having issues with. Oh, well, Total Disk here. As a uh, Titan X, and we cannot get 60s on the highest setting on 1080p. So that's kind of a <laughs> we want that fuck disappointing we thing. Take this. Oh, I need food to replace my health. You cannot fix your arm anymore, as in the previous game. I also remember I'm recording, so it's bound to be a little better. 3 to 4 frames per second better. So it should be around 33 around here. Yeah, pretty disappointing. Alright, let's try... Okay, where? <laughs> where do I change the settings now? Oh, here. Okay. Let's try medium to see if it changes anything. Alright, it doesn't change much, apparently. I mean, the frame rate, not the quality of the game. Try the lowest. Yeah, now we have a drastic performance change. We have 15 to 20 frames per second more in lower setting. But so far it looks pretty good on lower setting, I gotta say. I'm kind of impressed. <laughs> I cannot understand why they chose to make it like this. Uh, they cannot complain, it doesn't look that bad. But we, I'm not getting 60s. And I don't see a way to get those. Okay, let's see 720, high settings. I'm afraid to go to very high settings, <laughs> honestly. But I might try it later on. Okay, 720p high settings. Ugh, well, it runs like. Pretty much the same as 500p, I think, for some reason. Like 5 7 frames per second boost from 900p. So we're not that bad, actually. It's playable with 750 Ti, and it's using half the processor, so it should be using like 60 to 70 percent of the, an actual i3 for 150. So keep that in mind. That means uh, the game will be playable for you if you have an i3. And if you have a 750 Ti, choose 900p or 720p in order to achieve playable frame rates or just 1080p low settings, which I don't recommend. In my opinion, it looks better on 900p with high settings. Now let's try the lowest setting on 720. Lowest setting on 720, we have. And we're not getting 60s. We're not maintaining that number. But it's very smooth, yeah. If you want 60s, low setting 720. Yeah. I'm disappointed too. Let's hope this 950 delivers better performance. Awesome. We're making the 
boat. We're making a boat. We are making a boat. <gasps> yeah, you're very smart too. <sighs> Let's far cry this game. Let's far cry this piece. I'm stuck. No, I'm not. Yeah, I can notice the draw distance for the foliage is pretty low. On low settings. Look at that one over there. It will disappear. Whoop. 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 Yeah. Pretty disappointing. <laughs> Try ultra no yeah let's try ultra on 720. Okay, <laughs> don't try ultra. Don't even dare to try ultra. <laughs> let's try very high. Yeah, ultra and very high are out of our lead by a lot. So just high settings. There's no way to play at very high or or ultra without being below 30. So keep that in mind. Okay, so that's it for now. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope we do more comparison between the 950 and the 750Ti on this game. So stay tuned for that. And well, thanks for watching and I will start doing the 950 video. Stay tuned. Bye.